Yo, 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 Zach Calhoun here. Hope you're doing well today. Um, got a quick video for y'all um, inspired by today's uh, coaching call for BTPF, which is our virtual tour profit system training program. Um, every week we have coaching calls. And so this week we had a pretty cool, pretty cool court coaching call where I ended up on the calling and on the phone um, to help one of our members stir up some prospects in a specific niche in his area. Actually, the the niche was nursing homes, um, and I'll go through that uh, here in a moment. But what was cool was um, I also showed him how we we prospect and some, and I, I, even, I even had a wireframe out, and I was showing it to him, and I was like, you know what? Let's show these to these to the folks on the outside. So if you're a digital media company or if you're a marketing company and you want to know okay, how do I properly wireframe and build out a whole prospecting campaign that I can then remove myself from or hire human capital to insert themselves into so that they can um, run the campaigns for me. I want to just like show a visual here today. It's something that we're using. Uh, I think it'd be super helpful to you. Get you kind of a steep, steep peek of what it looks like inside when you have a, uh, a machine that's, that's, that you've built for your business. Okay. So check this out. Um, this is the wireframe, uh, a customer journey for some outbound prospecting campaigns that we've built. Uh, I'm gonna kind of walk through it with, with you today in these next few minutes. So stick with me. Um, I actually titled this, How to Prospect 15,000 Customers. So quick background story. Um, when this morning, when we walked through some examples of nursing homes, actually in the Northeast part of the country, um, we, we found a company that owns 10 nursing homes, 10 locations, different services, but they have 10 locations. Um, and we quick, quickly found all the emails of the company. And for, and for this company size, it was about 50 people. Okay. Um, and instead of just blasting out emails to all of them, um, I just called them on the phone and found the right person and prospected that person, uh, got into her voicemail, uh, emailed her and found her on LinkedIn and basically swarmed her from all, all, all the angles, right? Um, so that's one way to go about it. Now, sometimes when the businesses have an, a lower average number of people that work there, like 50, 50 is a lot, um, you're not going to be able to, it's, it's, it's sometimes it's better, slower, but better and better value to make phone calls. But you can't always do it yourself, right? So let's hypothetically, you have a database of 15,000 possible customers, just like Cloud Pano does, of leads who are not currently customers, like could be cold, ice cold prospects, but you wanna prospect them. And, and also a quick note, if I, I get emails sometimes from folks that will say, hey, so I emailed 30 people, no one responded to me. You know, and, and it makes me kind of laugh because the truth of the matter is, you need to be prospecting um, thousands of people each month. If you're not doing that, you're not going to get the, you, you don't have enough data points to even know if your messaging is off or, or on or, or what it is. So, so I'm going to go through like kind of our process on what it looks like. And this will hopefully, hopefully enlighten you to what it really takes to have success in business in any business endeavor. Okay. Um, you may see all types of businesses out there, like, you know, Amazon FBA or drop, you know, drop shipping or whatever drone businesses or whatever it is. But at the end of the day, like sales is key. Like, like how many eyeballs see my message that solves their problem is a huge metric. So let's, I'm going to kind of just show you what it looks like to have a healthy system in place that books demos over and over again and how you run thousands of people through this system and it fills up your calendar. Okay. So let's start from the top. Okay. So each one of these boxes represents a touch point or something, something in their journey. Okay. So if we have a large database of people, you can download lead databases, you can build them yourself, you can go to associations, you can pull domains and pull emails off of all the domains if you want to. There's lots of ways to build databases. Okay. We just, we discuss all those uh, special super fast ways in uh, the BTPS program. So we, if we're sending out uh, cold emails, our messaging is different than if we found the right person. So this is really important and probably, probably obvious, but when you send out cold campaigns to folks who, who just don't know, you don't know if it's the right person, if, if I'm talking to the janitor, who am I talking to? It's, it's okay to say, hey, I'm looking for some help. Would you mind forwarding to the right person who handles 
this category. So if you're, if you're specifically only offering 360 virtual tours to that niche, or if you have some other marketing services, you're gonna to wanna to use terms like photography, marketing, basic terms, so that they can forge into the right person. Now, most of the time, well, I don't know how often this happens because it's impossible to know, but folks don't always reply to you, hey, here's the person's name and email and phone number and where and address and, and social security number. Obviously, they, they don't do that. Sometimes they'll just forward your email quietly to the best person, to the correct contact. Okay. And if you email five subordinates and they all forward your email, you might get an email response that says, please stop emailing us. That's okay. That's going to happen. But more often than not, you're going to get a kind response of, from, from folks that tell you, actually, I think the right person is my boss named Sandy, you know, or which in this case, Christine was the person we, we found. Um, so that's going to happen. You're going to get people to forward you the right people. So within that cold message, you may have to have a loom video or a video about, Hey, here's the three things we do a minute and a half video, quick video showing what you do. What's an example, bring up a cloud panel demo. Here's what this is what we're making three CC virtual tours. Here's how they look. Here's the three benefits. It makes your place look beautiful. Booster SEO, you know, you can add them on the, on the street view and you have full control and you can do cloud panel live, you know, something like that. You don't have to go in the super detail. Quick, point, punchy, pointed, easy. And you have to really know what's viable to the customer. So you, you have to rework these all the time. So as you have more demos, you'll see down here, you're going to come back and rework the messaging so you can book a higher booking percentage rate. Once you find the right person, so I'm going to kind of um, highlight this here. So, so we start off with cold campaigns, okay? Cold emails. Hey, look, look for a little bit of help here. Once we find the right person, it comes down to what we call lead prioritize. So this person, we found the right person, okay? We handle this in our CRM. We, we use the CRM called close.io. Um, it doesn't matter for right now. You can use, use a spreadsheet. I have 50 companies I'm looking for. I found the right person for these. You know, I, I found 15 of the right people. Cool. When you find the right person, you can always reference the person who forwarded you. Say, hey, listen, I got forwarded your name from Tim or this person forwarded me your name, et cetera. Um, when they do that, I, they're kind of like, if, it, if it's their boss or president or owner in this place, if your cold email hits the right person, that's, a, that's the boss. They kind of have to book a demo, which is pretty nice. So you don't want to always be shy with, oh, no, I only, only want to email the right person. So, sometimes you want to email a bunch of people and have them forward you the right person. That's a good thing. Um, you, you, you'll get their attention at least. So we always send out three emails. So you'll see here, one, two, three, found my person emails. The, the, the response rate for the third email is like 20% higher. Okay. It's very low for the first email. It's just the way it is. All right. Um, so we're in that email, we're forwarding them to a, to a demo booking page or a calendar page. Okay. That's what we're doing. We're, we're forwarding them to the same calendar. Our team shares a calendar. We share a calendar so that we can all be funneling people to the same place so that our calendar can get full that every, but, and also we have good show up rates. Everyone's time, everyone's available, right? So we use a, we use an online calendar that is shared and available. So it's automatically finding a free space in my calendar. And I manage that calendar each day. So if I have personal stuff come up, I just block the calendar out, et cetera. Or I can pu pull myself off a, off a calendar, or add somebody on it, and we all share the calendar. See, also too, we recently Im implemented a um, an appointment setter. Huge deal. This has been like really fun to see actually uh, take place. When you hire an appointment setter, we, we hire appointment setters overseas. Um, you got to vet these people. When you post these kind of jobs, be aware. <laughs> You're going to get all kinds of really bad applicants, but I mean, you don't want a thick accent. Listen, I get spammed all the time. Okay. My phone, I'm a, I'm, I'm a business owner. I get spam calls. I just, bloop, don't even, I don't have time to even give an answer. Okay. But when you find someone like we found a great, a great guy who's got a great accent, I mean, almost basically no accent. It sounds like he's from California, even though he's from Pakistan. Um, and he's fantastic. So we have him place outbound calls after a, someone, a certain lead in a certain in companies have seen our emails. So if they've seen our emails, it's been a few days, no, one, no one's responded, then they're moved to a specific list where he can now call them. Hey, hey, how you doing? Um, I'm with Cloud Panel. I want to see if you want to book a time uh, to, have, to, to see our software. So because we're prospecting, we're prospecting as as a software provider. This is what software, software, software providers do. This works very well for also for local service for, service for providers as well. <laughs> Excuse me. The, the service doesn't matter, okay? This prospecting campaign 
works. Okay, that's all you need to know. Um, but we use, but, 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 but we definitely utilize this kind of stuff for selling software. So really important to know that, know that as well. Okay. So we have this demo booking page right here. We also send out LinkedIn campaigns. We have automatic, automated LinkedIn campaigns happening all the time. It's super powerful. I mean, we're talking. We we have the right title, uh, in the right industry, and in the right location. This stuff. I mean, link, LinkedIn has been amazing for us. Um, actually, um, I recommend that. I mean, if you're in if you're in Houston, Texas, and you're trying to find you know uh, realtors, you're going to find all the ones that are on LinkedIn. You know, simple. And you can automate that whole process as well. Which is what, what we do. So also, we and it's more advanced. But as you get people to look at your links or look at stuff, you're going to want to um, retarget them with Facebook. So you have Facebook ads that are retargeting them to a different inbound calendar. You're going to want to track that. Uh, and once they book a time, you're going to want to send them to a specific thank you page. Um, a war, I mean, and this is where your warm content should live. Okay, so as things change, you can update, update this page, or you can see what works, what, what doesn't work, etc. This is where your call, cost per call tracking code is going to go. You're going to want to track your cost per call here. Okay, some marketers are going to say, "Yeah, no duh," but if you've never been exposed to this before, it's really important. You know, having there, having a calendar link that redirects to a thank you page is very important, so we can track the cost per cost per call. Right. Also, what we do is we send a confirmation email. So we have a Zapier um, Zap set up where we send a confirmation email. We ask them to reply to the email. Here's the deal. Showing up is a big deal. We want folks to show up to the call. OK, we have to have to put, push for that. Right. We, we, if folks don't 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 show up, that, that's not good. Right. We, that's what you want, we want folks to be there. So you want to request them to confirm. OK, it's really important. Then our demo calls themselves. OK, they're very specific. We use a Cloud Panel Live link. Okay, Cloud Panel Live, 360 selling, virtual selling is the future. Okay, every industry is going this way. So if your software, Cloud Panel, has streaming video call capability, which ours does, you're gonna want to show it off. Sell, selling by demonstration is actually super easy. Okay, you can just show them an example. Here's what it looks like. Here's what we're doing. You can ask questions on the call. You can pass back and forth control you can draw on the call this this stuff man this is huge it makes a huge difference for us okay i highly recommend using cloud piano live if you don't have that uh, become a, a pro plus member or test it out uh, it's also pro plus is included with btps which which is what this what, where we detail all these steps uh, in more detail okay so when you demo someone you're gonna have a pricing agreement in place some type of quote itemized showing kind of what your repeatable pricing is if you don't, if you customize every time that's okay but you're going to have one of those things ready to fire off in your in your inbox and then move this person into your follow-up campaigns okay if this is a two call close situation you need to book a follow-up follow -up time on the call before you hang, hang the phone up before you stop the video call hey listen when's a good follow-up date give me some more feedback okay folks get busy get them on the calendar really important okay when you go to close and onboard someone, okay, or in the, and if you're going to book or, or schedule an appointment, you need to use the phone, okay? F f call to close, call to close. How can I say it a thousand times? Call to close. Um, I learned this from my dad. Uh, he's in the construction space and he's moved over $50 million worth of projects over the last few years. And we, he, he, he does this by getting things done, by being on the phone. In the construction world, there's no emailing going on. You're calling. Everyone calls. I can't express enough how important it is to call human beings. They want to be called. They may be busy. Who cares? Call them anyways. It's a really big deal. Okay. Um, I am just checking in. How are things going? That's all you got to say. Um, now, you could, there could be a training call. There could be you know certain things you're doing. Um, you, but there could be an onboarding page. You send folks. This is stuff that we do. Um, so know that. Your system of prospecting needs to be defined like this. This is how you have success. This is how you're going to be able to pump through a thousand to two thousand people a month in the top of your funnel, and then send them into here, right? And automate what the, what, what what takes place here. Okay, you need to, you're going to have to retarget them. You're going to want to follow around with ads. Use 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 display ads on Google. Use retarget on Facebook. These these are things that are not that hard to set up. If you set them up, you build a machine, right? You know, one of the biggest problems with being a service provider is not that you can't do a good job. It's that 
you're doing the job and you neglect the front of the funnel, right? So you need to have human beings that are pushing this for you or robots, you know, email automated, automatic email prospecting campaign softwares with email that, that exist, CRMs that exist, and with, with even with LinkedIn that exist. Okay. These things have to be always chirping little army men out there going, booking demos for you. Huge deal. Okay. If you want to learn more about how this works, how we use virtual tours, how we really sell like big clients, um, and also how to, do, how to do it repeatedly, what, how to use messaging, how to have demos, um, how to set up all the automations, all the how-tos and step-by-step processes are set up in BTPS, the virtual, the virtual profit system program. If you haven't heard about it, uh, we detail it at the end of the webinar at virtualtourprofit.com. So grab a time at, at the webinar. It's free. Um, it's free, free, free web, web webinar. You just click reserve a seat, grab a time. Uh, you can watch the streaming webinar. Um, and it's a lot of fun. It's a helpful webinar. It's free again, so you might as well watch it. And my hope is that you can get those first few wins. Like we had a guy named Ronnie who pre-sold some hotels in a different country and he joined BTPS because he, he pre-sold them virtual tours. So, so this is what you must do. You must go through the process of validating pre-selling, learning the ropes so that you can go build big systems. And keep in mind, it doesn't matter if it's virtual tours, photography, marketing, software. If you have a prospecting system that works, any industry, any value exchange, it's at your fingertips, right? So all, you, all you have to know is just, all you have to do is just understand the pieces of the puzzle, right? So go learn them. Uh, you could YouTube these things for and try to YouTube and try to YouTube and take a long time, or you can just accelerate your process, join VTPS, and get moving next week, right? That's what you that's what you want to do, honestly. Just go faster, invest in yourself. A players invest in themselves. I think we all all kind of intuitively. Already, already know that. Okay, that's it for now. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it was enlightening. Prospect the heck out of a lot of people. That's going to help you. Okay, the more people you talk to, the better. All right. Um, talk soon. Thanks for watching join this video. And if you're not already, become a Cloud Pano Pro Plus member today at cloudpano.com. I'll talk to you soon.